So today we're going to talk about the SpectraCell lab test. This is a test that we find a lot of clinical utility for. And really what this test is, it's a micronutrient test. And when we talk about a micronutrient test, what it is we mean by that is it's a test that assesses your vitamins, your minerals, your various antioxidants, and also some of the different metabolites, as well as looking at indications for how you're managing your carbohydrate metabolism. So this is a simple blood test simple blood draw, uh, simple phlebotomy draw that most uh, individuals are accustomed to, so no different with that. Uh, very unique in that it doesn't have to be fasted. And, and what's even more interesting about this test is that this test, because it doesn't have to be fasted, is this is not like looking at a, a serum test to assess your nutrients. Many individuals are accustomed to looking at things like serum magnesium, serum B12, but those tests are really looking at more of a moment in time as far as what's, what the nutrient status is. The spectrocell micronutrient test really goes far beyond that in that it looks at the intracellular levels of these nutrients and it looks at them in the white blood cells. These are actually living tissue, so we can see by looking at that living tissue whether there's enough of that nutrient in the cell to help that cell replicate and to keep it viable, or if there's not enough of that nutrient in the cell to keep it healthy and viable. What we typically find with this for the average individual is that there's about on the average anywhere from four to six, even up to seven, potentially eight nutritional deficiencies that show up in just the average individual. This is also quite interesting given that many of these individuals that we're testing for this on their initial assessments are doing some type of supplementation and still showing up in a deficient state. Most importantly, we also want to recognize that these nutritional deficiencies are also are basically barricades or blockades to your metabolic function. So not having adequate nutritional status, you can think about this as everywhere you have a nutrient deficiency, every system that's dependent on that nutrient deficiency is essentially not going to be running at an optimal status. So and, and looking at that and understanding that, this, is a, this allows us to be able to correlate this back to directly to specific lab conditions, to specific clinical conditions, disease states, that we can utilize this information to more clinically address and be more specific in the treatment protocols that we set up. If you have any questions about the, the SpectraCell micronutrient test, please feel free to get in contact with us. We would be happy to, to discuss this test and the utility of it more at length with you.